Hey guys, it's Shayna, and today I have a review for you. Happy New Year, first and foremost. Um, since this is a brand new year, it's 2016, I have decided that I want to try new things in the new year. So, one of the things that I have been dying to try is new makeup. Who doesn't want to try new makeup? I am typically a creature of habit, so I don't change. Like, if I find something that I love, I love it. I won't, like, I'm very loyal to it. Won't try anything else. But in the new year, I do want to try new things and new products. So today, we are going to review the CoverGirl Plumpify Blast Pro Mascara, as well as the Oh Sugar Tinted Vitamin Infused Lip Balm. Ooh. So I did receive these products for review. The um, opinions are my own and they are genuine first reactions because today is the first day that I am using them and trying them. And I must say right off the bat, I really do like the mascara. Like it's working for me. I'm not a fan of falsies. I've never really... Uh. Yeah, I never really got into wearing falsies, but I do love a good mascara to lengthen and stretch out my eyelashes, so it looks like I have false. Now, what I will say is, it definitely um, seems like I got every single lash, like no lash was left behind, especially towards the corner of my eye. That tends to be like the hardest part and I really like this wand because it does twist and turn and it does have like little a curve to it so it kind of helps to really get in there and get your lashes going girl. Um, but it suggests that you start from the base of your lash and then lift and then shimmy your way up from root to tip, which is exactly what I did. So it seems like my lashes are more separated. Um, I do really, really like that it lengthened my lashes just like my, like my favorite mascara does. That is one of my must situations. Like I need that to happen in order for me to even remotely consider a mascara. And this one definitely does that. Um, I actually found this wand a tad bit easier to use just because I am one of those girls that when I put on my mascara, I'm flipping and turning and all that normally, but I really didn't have to do that. All I really had to do was just lift and pull and shimmy as the card suggested, and it really did get in there. In 2016, this might actually replace, shall I say... It might actually replace my Maybelline. Like I have been, I have been so loyal to Maybelline's the Volume Express Colossal brand and line that <laughs> I think CoverGirl might have actually. Ooh, ooh, girl, I'm growing up. Yeah, I I think I've graduated to, <laughs> to CoverGirl's Plumpify now because I like the way it treats my lashes. So another thing I like about this mascara is it's buildable. After you have put on, you know, your first layer, do your other eye, you can come back and put on another layer so that it helps it look more full and longer. So I just put on like an extra like three coats of mascara and it is starting to get a little clumpy. And I think that's just because I just went way overboard. This was the side that I put all of the layers on. And I left this side with about two layers. And I can see the difference. I don't know how, how well it's going to pick up on camera. But I can definitely see the difference in the mirror. This side is definitely a little more clumpy. So you only need like two, maybe three good layers of the mascara and you're done. Unless you like clumpy. In that case, go for it, girl. Let's go ahead and compare it to the Oh Sugar Lip Balm. This one came in Sprinkle, which is what I am wearing right now. And for a tinted lip balm, this is really pigmented. I swatched it on the back of my hand so that you can see that it definitely does layer very well. It's very moisturizing. 
doesn't taste like anything but it smells really good kind of took me back to my childhood to lip smackers y'all i've just dated myself like i don't even think do they make that anymore doesn't matter um, it's not sticky at all it glides very well it does transfer just a bit. I went ahead and kissed the back of my hand. You can see the shimmer and the lip print just a little bit, but most of the product is still on my lip. That's a plus. I am really enjoying both of these products. Um, I feel like it's a very good investment if you want to try something new. These do definitely come in a range of colors. And personally, I feel like this is, it might be a good alternative to lipstick for me, especially during the winter because my lips tend to dry out a little bit more. It is infused with all kinds of vitamins and oils and all kinds of stuff like that. So it's really, really hydrating and really, really good for your lips. So all in all, I would have to give the Oh Sugar, I like saying that, Oh Sugar, ooh. <laughs> to give this like honestly a 4.5 out of 5 and that's simply because the lip tint is really pigmented and it's really hydrating and the mascara one it gets a 4 big kudos to the construction of the wand imagine what it would do if I had on false lashes like I think with false lashes this would definitely like take it to the moon girl Alright guys, so that's it. I really hope you enjoyed this review. Um, give me a thumbs up if, or let me know in the comments if you have other products that you want me to try out. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss anything. It's a lot of good things coming up in 2016. Oh, and share this review with a friend because, you know, we need to help each other out, girl. Alright guys, that's it. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Bye.